Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is a very short video tip of the week showing you how to do a neat little trick in Sony Vegas Movie Studio Platinum 9. This also works in Sony Vegas Pro. This trick, I'm going to show you how to quickly adjust the audio for your audio tracks when you have multiple audio tracks and you want to raise and lower the volume quickly. As I've shown in another video, what you want to do is put your mouse in the audio track control bar, right click and select insert remove envelope and choose volume envelope. Once you do that, normally what you'd have to do is put bars and change the volume envelope around. But if you hold down the shift key, put your mouse on that volume envelope control bar, the purple bar there, you can actually move it around by drawing like this. So I can raise it up, I can draw it down, and I can do it what I want. Now let's undo that and adjust it so it works with the track below. So what we want to do is put our mouse right here where we want to bring it down. Because what I want to do is that when the sound effects come in, I want to bring the volume down. So I'll bring it down by using my draw key, take it back up, keep it up until the next one comes down, draw it down, keep it up all the way over here, bring it down, bring it up. Then you can see what I'm doing. I'm just drawing where I want my volume levels. Then once I'm done, I can come back and adjust these to put them where I want them to be. So I'll straighten that one up. I'll move this back over this way a little bit. But it's a really easy trick. All you have to do again is right click in the music control track, select insert remove envelope, choose to insert a volume envelope, put your mouse on the volume envelope track, hold down the shift key, and you can draw that volume envelope any way you want. Neat little trick. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips. You can find more like this at my website, which is www.bmyers.com or on my video, 101 Tips and Tricks for Sony Vegas Movie Studio, which is also at my website as well as at Amazon.com.